So normally I would go into my studio and I'd get all done to address something like this, but um, I am feeling it in the moment and I feel like I just wanna vent a little bit and talk about just the hatred some people have for other people. Um, so I was getting my nails done and as I normally do every three weeks and I hadn't had time to go through my emails because yesterday we had a big shoot and we were doing a ton of stuff and I am a little behind on the emails because of holidays and we literally, I literally did personally four weddings last week. I traveled for one, so I couldn't really get into my emails and delve through them as much as I normally do. So I was just scrolling through while I was getting my pedicure, had a little time. My eyes got tired of looking at content from yesterday. And um, it said, Jay left you a review on the knot. And I was like, that's weird. We haven't had a client with a J in a minute. I mean, we have one on the 31st. And so I pull it up and it's a one star review. I'm like, that's really weird. Like I can usually get a vibe from somebody if they don't really like us or anything like that. So I read through the review and it says, Sarah is garbage. She uses trash makeup and she ruined my big day because she uses cheap makeup and I broke out during my ceremony. Now, at first, my reaction was like really emotional. I got really upset about it and I didn't quite understand. I'm sitting here in the parking lot, I gotta take this off. I didn't quite understand, like I was just, like my head was spinning because I've only gotten like a couple bad reviews in my 12 years of career. And so, and a couple of them were totally valid and some of them weren't at all. And the only thing that we have as business owner, owners as our tools is to respond to them. On Google, I actually have a ton of fake reviews from people who have never come into us. Um, so just, I've had to deal with this a lot and I've had a lot of hate come towards my way because I've always been outspoken about what I believe in, whether it be religion or politics or anything of the sort when, um, and people go and trash my business and my work as if that's valid to my opinion about how I feel about the national debt. And I'm tired of it. I'm tired of the hateful attacks. I have been a shit person before and I will own up to that. If I've ever written you a bad review and it wasn't real and things like that didn't happen, feel free to reach out to me and I will delete it because if those things didn't happen and I was just being a shit person in my 20s, then I feel like, you know, you deserve that retribution because it's actually not a real um, reflection of your business. However, if you just hate someone and you go trash their business and write bad reviews, and this goes for anything, I'm talking politics, personal beliefs, religion, anything. The only person that's garbage is you. You're the garbage person for writing that review that has nothing to do with their business, with their actual craftsmanship and work, and with all of the time and effort that they put in it. And not only that, if they have employees and you're trashing their business, you're taking money out of those employees' pockets, their families, and ours. You are taking food off of their table, the rent and mortgage payment out of their bank account. That is you and your responsibility. You are the trash person. Not the business owner, not the employee for having their opinions, for having their style, for having their religion, all of that. You are the trash person. And I'll be honest with you, it got me at first but I hope to God that's a real review because they wrote so much garbage in that they couldn't even own up to their own name in that review. And if I find out who you are, I'm gonna pray for you because you need it. You need it because you have hate in your heart and anybody who has hate in their heart, you need help and I'm sorry for you. Merry Christmas.